Hello ladies and gentlemen, this is Pangolin Advisor and you're about to watch day one of our incredible massive multiplayer Stellaris event. More than that, a narrative-driven massive multiplayer Stellaris event, which is a handful to say, I admit. But basically the deal was that we had 12 players in total, plus one observer, all together in a game that lasted for three days, four hours on each day, so not entire three days, but still four hours each day for three days in a row. And uh, to make it even more special than that, we we're given modified starts, so we didn't just start as if we clicked the new game button, but instead the uh, save file was modified, so some people start with more than one planet, some people start with a bigger or smaller fleet, and so on and so forth. And again, I did mention this was a narrative driven experience, which means that we were given a pre assigned empires, so we, the players, were not able to pick empires for ourselves, we were given the empires, and alongside the empires, we were, we were also given the objectives, such as this one, for instance, which, were, which was my set of objectives from day two. And as you can see, completing these objectives would grant me special bonuses for the next day, that being, for instance, more alloys, more unity traditions or more score even because the score was added at the end of last day to determine the winner of the entire event. All in all, this was an absolutely fantastic event. I had a really great time playing it and the Void Guardians were also super fun. There were also a bunch of other rules. For instance, I was not able to ally anybody who had the opposing fanatic, set, fanatic setting, or rather fanatic ethic. For instance, since I was playing as the Void Guardians, the fanatic xenophobes, I was not allowed to ally fanatic xenophiles, which actually became rather important as the game progressed. So, lots of fun things. I cannot claim the credit for coming up with this format, however, because this game was hosted by Darren from Republic of Play, so he's the one responsible for this, and he was streaming this game as an observer. I, however, was simply a player who was live-streaming my own perspective. So, without further ado, I only have one more thing to say, and that is to say that on day one we had a few technical issues, which forced us to restart the game entirely about one hour in, and then start a new one, which then thankfully didn't have any more technical issues. But in the end, this resulted in a fake day zero session, I guess, which never happened. So if you want to see the session that we had to cancel and uh, the session that we were forced to start anew, that is on my old channel. It's still in the same playlist, so you should be able to find it quite easily. But this session is the new start, so all the way from day zero, day one rather, until the game ends, you can just watch this video and then the ne next videos are published later down the line once I'm done editing them and you'll be caught up to everything. So now I'll shut up and let you watch this amazing spectacle. I hope you enjoyed just as much as I enjoyed playing it. Thank you and uh, have fun! Very well, we have now started. I'll change my scene and introduce myself again. And, uh, okay, I won't do that. I guess, suppose the other thing will still be a uh, video in and of itself. Since we already started, I suppose there's no time to lose right now. So let's go ahead and go ahead and uh, start doing exactly what I did before. Survey as many systems as I can, try to grab the most important things. Get the ships going, because I need to have more science ships ASAP. A lot more science ships, because that's what I did last time. Let's skew up some research. Last time I went for capacity overload. I don't have to repeat exactly what I did last time. In fact, I'm going to change a few things around. Actually, monthly unity went, worked well for me. And coal gun, why not? Let's get some coal guns as well. Let's upgrade my craft. And the construction ship, it might as well go to the void. And yeah, I'm going to start by adopting the expansion uh, tradition as I did before. Also, now I know what I'm doing and I remember something, so it should be better. So I'm going to go ahead and go for uh, some of the policies and edicts I went for before. So I'm going to go for mixed economy, ASAP. Trade policy is good. Food policy is going to be nutritional plentitude. It should be fine, I hope. Everything else is just fine. Okay, new science ship is ready. Let's go ahead and recruit one more scientist and get the one that gives me better survey speed. It's the exact same guy I had before, which is wonderful. Okay, let's go ahead and survey this system, because these two systems, this one and this one, are essential to my success. I want them. I grabbed them very early on last time, and I'm right in between 
three powerful players, so I need to grab them again like I did last time. It's very important. Meanwhile, I'm going to get one more science ship, which already is in construction, which is excellent. So, I'm trying to figure out if I do post it complete. as a new video, what will I say? Well, I'll probably explain the situation, so I guess I will need to record some extra video to explain exactly what happened. I mean, it makes sense, right? So, in case I don't do that, however, I'll just reintroduce myself as Pangolin Advisor and let you know that, unfortunately, and the, this is being replayed as because things kept crashing for people for an unknown error, most likely due to a patch that rolled in just uh, moments before we started playing, which is very unfortunate. And we're now playing this all from the start. So this game is a massive multiplayer Stellaris game with 12 players and no AIs whatsoever. And we each have our different agendas, goals, that if we complete, we'll be given extra stuff later down the line, which is very fascinating, very interesting, and it will allow us to gain some bonuses if we do complete these objectives. So let Diosa please travel to the unknown. I know where it leads to, of course, but either way, I want him, this guy, to travel there. And this guy, as soon as he's done checking out what this area is all about, which I already know, I'm going to send him to this survey, this system right over there. So trying to replay it in the exact same way as I did last time. Quite important, you see. Let's move this construction ship over there. Let's get another construction ship. I do need one more and another science ship, and then I should be good for the most part. I'll just quickly check what they say. <laughs> and so far so good, an anomaly that I will leave be for now. It's not important, I have other things that are very important to do. And the science ship, yes. So I want to get to this unknown star, uh, black hole ACP, because I know this is where I want to expand to. Are there any other black holes in the vicinity? None that I can see. There's one right up there, but it is real far away. I'm not saying this area isn't far away, but this other one is even further away, so you know. That's quite something. So with that in mind, everything is going okay. I did forget to do things on my home planet, but I can make this a good thing actually. So firstly, I will get another mining district because I'll go very low on minerals very quickly. This is going to be my research system, but it doesn't have to be as quickly as it was last time. I'll go for... I do want research labs. It gave me quite a bit of an edge over everybody else, so let's go for research labs. As I did last time, I'll have some issues with consumer goods, but it should be sorted out relatively quickly, I hope. And let's go for some, let's see, civilian industries as soon as I can. Actually, I should go for them on this system, because that's where I have more problems with unemployment, but I'll see what happens at that point. Am I muted? No, I am not. Everything seems to be working, which is excellent. Stream is fine and stable with the sound, and uh, audio volume should also be quite fine. Alright, so once you this uh, finish doing what you're doing, we'll just explore these systems, and then you will go back. Alright, I've got a new construction ship that will go over there, and a new science ship which needs yet another scientist, and that's going to be the adaptable one. That's actually better than what I had last time. And he's going to go in here and explore this wormhole, which is also pretty good because it lets me travel all the way to Kilo, which is an amazing system to have. And I should have grabbed it faster, I suppose. But I'll grab it. There's also a planet I can colonize right next to it. But since it has a very difficult anomaly on it, I doubt I will be able to do just that. Let's see what else do I want. I want new colonies to start with one additional pop. Hmm... Yes, I do want that first and foremost, since I'll expand quite quickly from now on. And I am not going to start working on a colony ship just yet. And I'm going to talk with the other empires uh, any moment now. Actually, no way, this would kind of break the immersion, wouldn't it? Since uh, this is a new universe and whatnot. But most of the players that were in the previous attempt uh, at this game agreed that... Uh, Agreed to have a gentleman's agreement of sorts to try to not overexpand System over what we had complete. before. So that is what I'm going to do. I will send this guy over here, however, just for really briefly. I won't explore this system, however, because I know I'm not going to get it anyway. Right, let's go ahead and make a starbase. Are you making a starbase? 
No, because it, this uh, planet system is not fully surveyed. All right. Well, I can wait for a little bit. This will be fine. All right. Once you finish surveying the system, please go ahead and survey this one. This is what I also grabbed last time, and it's quite important that I do again. Otherwise, my empire cohesion will be super low. Again, it was last time, but now I know about it, and I can maybe fight this. So let's go ahead and try to do that. There was a planet somewhere here. I think it was right here, most likely. And then I can go ahead and try to go to over here and explore, survey this system. Construction and then complete. survey this system. Because these are the systems I won the last time and got. An encounter with dangerous unknown. Right, that is an alien I met last time. Those are the better men and Xeno scam. I will research their language and I'll find out what they want. Meanwhile, I have a science ship that is awaiting orders. It needs to survey the system. And then after it's done, it needs to save that system and keep exploring further. So that's quite excellent. Now, as for the construction ship, it's still waiting for the Wemmall system to finish its stuff, to finish being uh, surveyed. I have the time to do this, however. Game speed isn't normal, and so far nobody's lagging. That's good. Talkmaster has a little bit of delay, but uh, last time we played, we were on fast and no issues were found, so this should be quite good. All right, excellent. As for making more ships, I there's no reason to start making a calling ship just yet. An odd factor, indeed an odd factor it is, although I didn't check what it said. Okay, I need more consumer goods, so I'm going to go ahead and make them on my complete. capital. It has a bunch of people unemployed anyway, so civilian industries it is. Ooh, what is it? Remove old factory or a pub goes missing. Hmm. It suits our need. System survey complete. I'm sure this odd factory is fine. Leave be for now. Leader has gained trade. So I lost a population due to an odd factory. Well, that's fine. I suppose let's increase the population growth speed a little bit more. Let's grab some. Let's actually claim this system and Construct grab whatever it has. That's quite important. And yeah, there is an unsurveyed system which is an Arctic world, which is excellent for our species. However, the issue is it has an anomaly on it, which I cannot under any by any means actually scan because it's way too difficult to scan it. How is uh, this construction ship, this science ship doing? I think it's almost done. It's getting there, although there's still no need for me to make my colony ship. I'm kind of happy that I know now know what's happening. I'm less stressed out, I suppose. And yeah, I will need one more construction ship, I think. So third construction ship. Let's let us make the colony ship first. It's quite important. And let us then make another construction ship. I still have the alloys to do just that, so it should be fine. This planet also has things it can do, which is good. I. Cannot make any more mining districts, unfortunately. But I can make something else. If I chose to do so. Unfortunately, because I'm low on everything, including even minerals, I would rather not attempt to do such a thing. Alright, so, with that in mind, let me allow me to check what is uh, happening in a game chat that you cannot see. Hmm. Yeah, and apparently something's uh, changed, but this is fine. Excellent. Now, pardon me for being so surprised by everything, but I suppose this will be fine. You know what? I'll just publish things in order. This should be okay. And yeah, people are asking for fast speed. Darren probably wants to be careful and make sure that we have no desyncs happening. So that's why we're not on fast speed yet, but this is fine. Uh, this is understandable, but I think we can probably handle fast speed and we're probably going to have it on fast uh, relatively quickly. I assume. So there is an arid world in there, we knew about that. We will discard volatile modes, which we don't quite get, we just know they exist. And I'll be able to make good use of them in at some point in the future, but for the time being this is not exactly something that we need to concern ourselves with. Empire Cohesion is still fine for the time being, it will not last, however, I assure you. Alright. 
And do I really need another construction ship? Yes, I probably do, because I have many areas in the galaxy I want to uh, expand to, like I did last time. Although I need to be careful not to overdo it, because I might be a little bit overestimate. And Oh nice, the colony will keep its systematic production quarter, that's excellent. And now let's go ahead and grab a starbase. Well, this guy, just let us quickly explore the system to have a chance at discovering the aliens and then I'm going to survey that one while this scout ship is going to survey the system I had before which will link all of my systems together which is quite important. Anomaly found. Yeah, a challenging anomaly and Situla. That's going to be almost impossible to complete. But you know what? Let's go ahead and try to research it. Maybe it's going to be fine. So, with that in mind, let us see what is happening. We're still waiting for the speed to increase, so things are a little bit slow this time. Last time they felt System extremely fast complete. because I, was, I had no idea what is happening for the most part. So this is, I suppose, a nice change of pace. For now. Anyway, a new tradition is ready to be adopted. Let's go ahead and reduce the Starbase upkeep. Since this is the one that is the most immediately useful to us, right now we're still under the total Empire's Pro, although I will need to increase the capacity very soon, complete. since my cohesion will keep going down and even lower and lower still. This is going to be a constant problem for me. Alright, I've got a, plenty of jobs, but somebody is too important to work a job complete. at a factory. So it is sometimes, I suppose. A Gamma Menace has been discovered. So that is good to know. Anything else that I need to take care of? This guy's dealing with some anomaly that is fine. Wait, there were no anomalies on this planet this time around? Ooh, so things changed. Now this is an excellent place for me to colonize. And it wasn't before. Ooh, so this changed. Interesting and good to know. Hmm. So this, is the, this restart is actually better for me than it was before. Which is very interesting. Right, and there's another plant which I actually didn't notice before. So let us go ahead and the survey it. Has somehow deciphered our and then survey more systems. And we have this kind of divine mandate. So I'll just say, keep to yourselves, aliens. And we should assume the worst. Last time they were very powerful and they are still overwhelming in terms of fleet power. And yeah, because I started with no ships of any kind. So that is hardly surprising. I can't afford to make mining stations, well, so I'll... Uh, go to the marketplace and probably sell some some consumer goods we and a new buy some minerals because I'm in a hurry to get more mining stations. This is very important for me. Right, we're now on fast and things are starting to get uh, very scary in terms of how fast they are going. So let's go ahead and see. The standard world, it has 11 spots. This one also has 11. Actually, wait, 12 and 14, okay, so the colony ship should be going over here and enter the orbit, and I didn't check what this event did. Yes, I don't want to colonize this uh, planet, even though it has a low hab habitability, this is fine to us. So, construction ship over here, it is now ready to get to the other side of the galaxy and claim this thing, as soon as I have the influence to uh, afford that, of course. And I'll get more minerals from jobs as quickly as humanly possible. Okay, everything is uh, working in a good order. I have discovered the Delta Menace somewhere. I'm not sure where. Oh, that's where it is. Delta Menace. System survey complete. I suppose I could talk with them since this will give me more influence and I do want to get more influence. So let us go ahead and chat with the other players. I'll mute myself for a second. Right, let me check if I remember the hotkeys. Yes, I do. So I'm now uh, back over here. Commendable initiative. Yeah, let's keep doing this. So I messaged the other players. Hopefully we can all be friends and this will be quite a fantastic thing. Uh, the very least, that is my hope. So censorship is out of orders, which is quite interesting, I swear. Oh yeah, because it already surveyed this system. 
Well, I suppose it might as well keep serv help survey some other systems, like maybe actually go in this direction and find out what is happening in over in that part of the galaxy. Or alternatively, I can just check all the other systems in the area and see if there's anything interesting. And I'll use the other science ship to do the same as quickly as possible. So, again, I'm changing my tactics somewhat. I'm not scouting as fast as I was before, but it should be okay. Now my Empire's Pro is higher and I have an Ascension pack and the first one I get is uh, Technological Ascendancy which increases my research speed, so speed. So things haven't changed over there. Alright, this planet's gonna be colonized quite easily by me, which is wonderful, so as soon as I can, I'd like to make a star base in there. As this one is much cheaper to make than the other one. I still need to control the Singularity as this is part of my quest. And I'll show you the quest real quick again. That's what it is. These are the quests, and uh, I have to. I don't have to do them, but doing them will help me quite a bit. Let's research this. I don't think I'm in a hurry anymore. I discovered the most important systems I wanted to discover, so things should be okay. With that in mind, let us me check if anybody responded to my call. No, people are just uh, other players are talking amongst themselves for the time being, so this is fine. That's section should be out of orders. Well, I'm doing okay in many areas. I can make some more mining stations, but right now I believe it more to be more important to actually make some more minerals and energy as well. So let's make a mining district in here and on my capital. I can also make a mining district, which is quite tempting, but I cannot afford it right now. Besides, nobody would work it. I have more jobs than I have population, it's just this one it's posh it's bastard that doesn't do anything. So let's see, I discovered some three Yankee, that's fine. Construction ship. Move over there, and there is a trade offer. Divine Mandate gives uh, minerals in return for communications, I'll agree to that. So let us see. What else is happening? I've got a new research to we unlock. A new technology. I probably want more energy, or the fusion reactors are tempting, but yeah, let's get a new technology. Get more energy. And covered build speed increased. Quite tempting. Quite tempting indeed. I'll grab that and then I'll make some covets of my own, which should help establish my power. Let's go ahead and make. I don't actually know if I want to make mining stations in here, but I do have some uh, minerals to spare. That being said, research stations are probably more important. Routine anomaly, let's go ahead and research it. Meanwhile, I'm going to go ahead and start working on a brand new colony ship and keep expanding. My empire is very good at fast expanding due to its, uh, it being fanatic, xenophobe and authoritarian. I'm also an imperial empire as well, which is quite interesting. So with that in mind, my people are doing okay. Some of them are employed, unemployed, but I'm working on fixing that. And there's a space whale, System interesting. Okay, I don't have enough influence to make an outpost in there just yet, but I will at some point see a routine thing. That's a very hard one, let's leave it be. And uh, so far so good, honestly. So let's see, something fascinating about something else somewhere. It's okay, let's move my... Hmm. Actually, let's go ahead and move this guy to this system. Just so I can see what is inside, so just so I can explore this area and then survey this system. I was trying to survey before and go over there. The reason is because I want. Actually, you know what? Never mind. Just keep surveying the system. It's way too important. And I'll just send my ex uh, construction ship the other way around. It should be fine. Okay, one more construction ship is waiting for orders, but that is because I'm waiting to get enough influence. And things are rolling again quite nicely, in fact. Is anything happening in the in game chat? <laughs> no, people are experiencing a deja vu. Alright, if people are rolling, so will I. Research some more, excellent, and I'll mute my microphone for a second just so I can type some more messages.
All right, I'm back and apparently there are some aliens in a black hole system. That is quite unfortunate, but hopefully it is uh, going to be all right. Hopefully it's nothing I cannot really deal with. More Gamma Menace is nearby. I should uh, discover a way to communicate with them as quickly as possible. And uh, hmm. let's study the space amoeba. I'm sure we can do that. Let's uh, adopt the discovery tradition so that we can find more things. And we found the Quintime Menace. I mean alliance, but I suppose it is a menace to us. I'll tell them to keep their distance and let's see. Oh, well I won't be able to do that honestly. There's a lost juvenile and I don't have a fleet of any kind, so I can't really fulfill this quest right now. This was the poor decision on my part. Let's go ahead and make a mining station over there. Let's see what else do I have. I've got my colony ship under ready. Let's move it over there to my new to colony to be. Still can't make this outpost. I need eight more influence, but this should be anomaly easily far. remedied. Let's research the, the anomaly. Okay, I've got one more science ship. And let's survey the system. There's no reason not to. And then let's go ahead and mastered a new technology. find a way to get to this black hole. We'll see how doable that is. Uh, meanwhile, this system, this ship is supposed to keep exploring these, these areas since I know that this system is very very powerful and very important for me to grab and that's quite interesting so with that in mind one more construction ship still waiting for orders and now it can make a star base excellent so now we've got what we've got is an um, energy siphon which i'm not sure what it's doing oh it is concerning okay it allows me to deal some damage with small weapons okay interesting i'm not sure if i want it really Instead I'll unlock re removing some blockers, because I'm not sure if I have those or not, but it would be good to know if that is the case. Construction complete. So let's see. Things so far are again exactly as they were before. One construction ship is awaiting orders. I can go ahead and grab this uh, plant as quickly as possible. Quentin Alliance seems to be moving quite aggressively in this uh, direction. Interesting and somewhat worrisome, but I hope there is nothing wrong happening. But I should redesign my ships, which is something I forgot to do. Corvettes are still... I just still don't have the technology to make corvettes faster, better corvettes, that being. But, oh, curate order. Excellent. But that being said, I will need a new corvettes ASAP. So let's go ahead and find a new corvette design. Get it to be the interceptor and fill it with cold guns and one laser because... I mean, diversity is always fun. Bunch of shields, and that is in fact a little bit too power hungry, so let's get some more armor. Although, that is fine actually. Let's give it a random name, save it, and there we go. And I'll start making some corvettes because I don't want to be powerless against enemies this time around, in case System I find them. Complete. And the guys around me, like, there are plenty of uh, potentially evil empires around me, so I don't want to risk it if I don't have to. So this area is very tempting to have, but I am not willing to grab it because it's too risky. And let's see. Oh, the Great Quintalian League has uh, declared the Quintai Alliance their uh, rivals. Well, I'm not declaring anybody my rivals, so I'm trying to stay as neutral as I can be. So let's see what else we have We've got. Nothing important in the Empire Capital, people are unemployed just because they're too lazy to work, that's just how it always we is, as it, I suppose. New technology. new technology found, that is good, and let's see, what do we have here? One pub that could be working something, and I want this place to be my science new research research center. So I can do this quite easily by getting more research labs. New anomaly, let's go ahead and research it. Meanwhile, this singularity is now mine, which is excellent, let's make some more research stations as I work on a new calling ship as soon as I'm done with uh, these corvettes. In fact, I can work on that a little bit faster, like so. How is my empire spread is a good question. The cohesion is very, very poor actually, and this causes the empire sprawl to be already quite over, highly over capacity, but this is nothing I cannot handle just yet. I can go for administrative AI, which is good. And if I want to fix uh, my current issue, I can just make an outpost over there. And as for this colony ship, it's not doing anything right now, and it should, so let's go ahead and colonize uh, this planet. Give it a good name. Intriguing, intriguing. Feta Manus. And I get insights. Good breakthrough. Okay. 
I don't know if this is part of the situation log or not. But one of my quests is actually to investigate the L gates, so that is important and good to know. I found the exchange. Well, I have nothing to say to them just yet, but let's see. Construction ship in here. I do want a mining base, or rather a star base, to guard the system, but I cannot do anything right now, so I'll just we have mastered wait for a lot while. This guy can already go to blink. This is a very nice system I really want to have, even though it will lower my cohesion even further, but this will allow me to lock down this uh, territory to some extent. Besides, Blink the is just super nice. Somehow deciphered and I found the most adorable empire in the universe. Beautiful. Protectors of Nar. Good to know what they are and where they are. Next up we've got science or service speed increase. I do want the service speed to be as fast as humanly possible. The galaxy is filled with secrets. I just have to know. Can get robot assembly plants and robot workers. Tempting. System but I do want more engineering research at first. Ancient survey marker, good. And this guy is now out of orders, right? System yes, he survey is. Complete. Okay, in that case, let's go ahead and explore more we areas. A new world for our people. Over there, because I think there must be some connection to those black holes in there. Actually, wait a second, I can go ahead and explore this black hole. Explore natural wormhole. Wormhole, not black hole. And actually, I know where it goes. It goes to over here. So that's good to know. Okay, I've got a few military ships. How strong are they in... Re hmm. Those guys are equivalent. And those guys are also equivalent. So I, I now have a fighting force comparable to those of my potential allies and or enemies. Good to know. Alright, trying to work hard on making everything flow as smoothly as possible. Now I need some more consumer goods, as well as more food and everything, but it's fine. And my colony has been established, so I need to can recruit another complete. administrator. The youngest will do, so let's grab this guy. And I have no energy credits all of a sudden, because I hired a guy. Complete. Oopsie, let's sell my minerals. So that is an issue, and I will need to work on fixing that as quickly as possible. Construction ship in here make mining stations get some more minerals that's very very important oh wow this system is actually amazing i need to try to check it as quickly as possible let's research the anomaly as well oh an arid world that's quite interesting let's survey it i didn't notice it in the previous game and let's survey this system as well and then check the natural wormhole system survey complete so, so far so good. Let's see what else we have. This construction ship is still awaiting Oh, this, this colony ship is now ready to go to Singularity. And finally we've got a science ship that is awaiting orders. I see. I don't know what it is supposed to do. But I guess I can just send it to over here and see what it can find. Well, let's go ahead and do just that. I may be forgetting some important things I did last time, that is entirely possible. Actually, I believe that is uh, that is exactly what's happening. I haven't surveyed this system, or this one, and this could be quite important. And these ones also are things I want to know about, if at all possible. So, let's see. This colony can make some more structures. I can afford it, so let's go ahead and start walking. I really want a mining district, like it will help me fix all my progress problems if I have enough minerals, right? That is my belief at any rate. We have mastered a new technology. That being said, for the time being, I need at least one energy district, generator district, that's very important. Right, this uh, construction ship is now done with its orders. Let's go ahead and make some more research stations, that would be nice. And as for this place, I kind of want to start trading a little bit more, so I could upgrade the starbase. And it's possible, but I want to have a relatively strong navy as well, System if at all possible. Complete. Better service speed, that is excellent, I want we that. Mastered a new, technology. new technology has been mastered, that is good again. And even more minerals, this is absolutely wonderful. So, so far I believe I'm doing somewhat better than in the last game, Only but that is to be expected, obviously. Since we now know, we now all know what we are doing. And, uh, mm, yeah, I think it's, uh, I think... We're doing quite well. I do want to know, like, one of my quests is not to interfere with other empires. We don't care about the Xeno world looking inwards, but I do need to kind of have some claims, like something going on between me and the other empires. Let's see. Those guys are equivalent. 
Those, those guys are equivalent as well. Let's see. What about the exchange? What is the exchange all about? Let's check their law because I haven't done that before. So the exchange. Cashflow, also known as the Capital Trade, tra uh, trade Center System and its surrounding neighbors, have one of the galaxy's rarest precious metals, organic material, complete. relics and technologies wonders. The discovery of these high value materials encourage a new type of space race. Not one fueled by scientific curiosity or political gain, but one of profit. So corporate uh, power blocks formed over hundreds of years and dominated the governments of the mining worlds they inhabited. Government bailouts became buyouts as banks collapsed and corporate aliens uh, fueled pro entities fueled progress. Eventually a common government was established when the big three began exchanging goods out of necessity and ultimately merged into one. With proximity to competition, the exchange seeks to sell all their wares to the highest bidder in order to fuel progress in a new galactic, uh, galactic salvation. Okay, interesting, interesting, interesting research. Yes, economic transmission, what is this? Quite the alliance with non-aggression. So, um, let's see, how, is it dangerous for them to be non-aggressive to me? I'll decline this and I'll answer in the chat. Uh, so, let's go for over here. And I'll mute myself for a second. Construction complete. Incoming transmission. System survey complete. System survey complete. All right, so this is a little bit of a risky move for me to de deny non-aggression pacts. But this is actually part of my quest, so that's why I'm doing this. I will agree to communications, though. Now, communications is a different thing, because, uh, I mean, it's just letting us know who we know, so it's uh, it's fine. It's absolutely fine. Traditions, uh, research, and I can increase the research station output, which is tempting. I'll get more research alternatives. I want more research station output. I have quite a few powerful research stations out there. Right, before I talk more in the chat, I'm going to see what else I have I can do about my area. So I will make some mining stations. Governor is a bad person apparently. Okay, good to know. And here I do want an outpost because this is absolutely a brilliant system. And there's a tomb world, which I cannot do anything with, but it's nice to know that it's there. This construction ship can't make a star base and not have enough uh, influence for to do that. You know what, this ship is out of orders, so... I guess I can explore this area and then survey these two systems and then explore some more areas because I'm curious where the Xenos are. Find out if something can improve on energy production. Yes, we're not dedicated militarists. We just are ready and willing to protect ourselves if need be. Also, this colony ship isn't expanding. I'm not sure why it is supposed to. Oh, because of an anomaly. Right, last time it was somewhere else. So where is the science ship? It's heading to these... That's where it is. Okay, you did, sir. Research the anomaly as soon as possible. I didn't notice the anomaly. Okay, so with that in mind, however, things are going okay. I can improve my ship's potentially, ship design. Marvelous! I can get more energy from jobs, that is excellent. Okay, okay, I don't care what else is happening. In terms of things, my ships cannot be improved, but I can have more ships, which is important. So let's improve my fleet a little bit more with just three ships. Well, that's all I can do, but at the very least I'll have three more ships, which will allow me to protect myself, at least act as a deterrent against other Xenos. Let's increase the plant build speed, that's quite important. I'm trying to make a lot of things very, very quickly. After all, I'm still losing energy credits, which is somewhat unsettling. I can make a generator district hub on my main capital, which I'll absolutely do, and we'll see what good comes of it. Other plants can... Well, this plant actually can't do anything until I research a way to get rid of wildlife, and this plant has too many of able to do so. So let's get this colony ship back to here, and uh, colonize this planet because the other ones I cannot actually colonize. Let us see quickly what is happening. The Walkers Republic announced that they will sign any agreements with Xeno for mutual benefit. 
<laughs> that is too good to know. System survey complete. So what is that? That's the Quinty Alliance. That's good to know that they are dead. They are not expanding towards this area thus far, so that is good to know. And the Amoeba Juvenile is now out of this area. Well, that's Construction complete. unavoidable. Oh, an Arctic area plant. I can actually colonize that. That's good to know. Complete. Anomaly found. What else do we have? A routine anomaly? Sure, let's go ahead and grab that real quick. So far, so good. So far, so good. I know I keep repeating that. But considering the stressful situation and circumstances, I, what else can I just say, really? That's a situation. In that. In a game like this. Well, let's go ahead and make a new... I don't really want to make a new star base just yet. Show us your wares and not interested in move along for the time being. What is that? The Winds of Fortune. The Numestic Order. What is the Numestic Order? Hmm... Numestic Order. We have mastered a new technique. I do not see a Numestic Order anywhere. Well, that was somewhat unsettling, but uh, so sad so it is. Construction complete. I'm sure it's fine. Let's make some more mining stations so that I can complete. actually start making more money. What is this thing? Like, seriously, is it... So I'm controlled by the cost of this game, it's very much possible. I'm not so sure. Leave this anomaly be for now, it's hard, so it's too difficult to complete. And let's get some more, uh, let's get some better fusion reactors, actually, that's probably quite important. Oh, these are caravania traders, that's good to know. Not interested, move along. Okay, a science ship is now out of orders, well, keep serving, keep serving. And then look for other black holes, if at all possible. Claimed a new world for our people. And you, yes, sir, once you're done uh, surveying this area, survey some more. Let's see what we can find. It is a construction ship. Uh, I don't care about the governor of stuff. I mean, it, might, it is potentially important, but nothing that I believe to be immediately important. Nothing that will get me killed, hopefully. This construction ship is still done, and uh, the singularity is still an issue, but there's much I can do fun. about that. New anomaly, which is easy, good. Let me check the uh, the meta chat, as I call it. So this is the chat of people outside of the main game. So, so far so good. Can I maybe trade something with the other people? Like, I'm losing food. So let's see, the exchange. Let's see if we can work on a trade deal. I'll give them... What do we, what do we have? I have uh, plenty of minerals, so... I'll offer them... 10 monthly in, uh, minerals, and in return I would like to have 10 food. Uh, minerals are more important we than food in my opinion, so they should technology. agree to this quite happily. Let's confirm and let's see if they agree to that. Alright, meanwhile let's have a quick look at uh, pub growth speed, it has been done and I can research clearing massive glacier tower blockers. I'll probably get that and the trade offer is uh, cancelled. Okay, that is unfortunate. I'll need to find somebody else System that can give me food. Well, I'll do that. System survey complete. All right, I'm back. I let's see if anybody answers to my call. I definitely need some more food. I can of course do it in the marketplace, but it's cooler to you know interact with other players. So I certainly want to do that. Ooh, that's a quite an aggressive maneuver. But their fleet power is inferior to mine. So everybody's fleet power is inferior to mine in this area. Interesting. Very interesting indeed. Well, wait a second. This area isn't explored. Surveyed rather. I wanted to survey this system. And then explore the other ones. Once it's trash. But this one's on, let's say once it's trash. So it's a time project. And I need a construction ship in orbit go to 
this area. Okay, no worries. I can do that. Let's go ahead and research projects in the system. I'll save the space trash and we'll see what I can do with it. Hopefully something amazing. Let's see if anybody answered my call. Hmm... Okay, so TDN boy is, seems like he's willing to make a trade deal with me, so let's go ahead and offer a trade deal. I'll we give them minerals. The Monthly for 10 years, and in return they will give System me food. So let's see what the productive of now want. Actually, uh, they already gave me uh, an offer themselves. So sure, I actually like it. Energy credits for food, sure. I'll probably mention that to the host on our meta channel and let them know. Oh, okay, insight. If I gain four of these, I'll fulfill one of my quests. This is going to be very interesting. The custom quests that give me a reward. So this is quite good. This science ship has nothing to do right now. But I can make a new colony ship. Well, not yet, but I'll be able to do in this. Uh, I'll be able to do that soon. Well, this ship right now, what it needs to do complete. is survey these two systems. Well, this guy claims blink like it did before. And you do, sir, keep claiming some other important systems such as Capella. It seems like a nice system to have. Mm, although this one also seems like a nice system to have, so I'll do that. And I'll go ahead and let the streamer know that I actually signed a trade agreement. And uh, I'll be right back. Alright, I have returned, let's research some more, some more stuff, so yeah, now everything is revealed. And things are going well. <laughs> I keep saying that, I need to figure out something else to say. Basic combat rules, ooh, that's actually a very important upgrade for my war machine. Let's see what else I have. Uh, I've got a science ship that is doing nothing whatsoever because there are aliens in there, good to know. I can also send the science ship somewhere else, maybe to aid this one in discovering these regions. Actually, this one. So, actually, this one ship has it covered, so I think it will be fine. So let's just discover these systems around here. Maybe it's something very interesting. There's a black hole in here with a curator order. Oh, sure. Let's survey as many systems as possible, and let's see if I can link them up somewhat. Because in case you forgot, the Empire has somehow oh wow, our I found a bunch of aliens which I want to kill them themselves. But anyway, in case you forgot, I need to link up my empire as much as possible to avoid the Empire's Sprawl, which right now is humongous and it caused and it caused me to have increased uh, uh, research costs and basically increased everything as far as it's as far as I'm concerned. So this is a pretty bad thing. So yeah. And congratulations, everybody! We just passed the year in which everything crashed. Yay! We're now going to be fine. Excellent. bit of roleplay is now finished and Special let's product. see oh maybe I can get the galactic market last time I had no chance uh, of grabbing it but, but now it's entirely different so I don't have the, I, the the influence which is a small issue but oh yeah, I am just lacking the influence and then I'll be able to contend for the galactic market which is very tempting and I do want it so let's go ahead and grab that meanwhile I probably want to have let's see the starbase Let's improve this thing to a starbase as well, so upgrade to a starport. A starport and not a starbase, that's what I meant. And this construction the ship Zeno is Empire out of all this. Oh! The Xeno Empire deciphered our language, somewhat troubling. What is this, an ocean planet? I don't care about that too much. Let's see, you this set. Go ahead and make a starbase in here. Well, this guy makes a starbase right next to our home system because a Vod Vodkradio is quite a nice place to be entirely honest. 
So, the machines have been uncovered. This is somewhat scary, I suppose, but I can still have more star bases. So I will make this thing into a star base, so that my borders are a little bit better protected. How strong is this guy compared to me? Inferior. Well, I could start picking on the weak. Question is who? Well, let's see who is in a, uh, opposed to our uh, virtuous. This guy is a authoritarian like we are and also found an a spiritualist. And this guy is a authoritarian militarist and spiritualist. I'm a little bit afraid by, uh, by the fact that he is a militarist, but we'll, I think I can declare rivalry. Let's go ahead and do that. Uh, he was quite aggressive before as well, in terms of his expansion and whatnot, so I think it's gonna be fine doing that. As for this guy, Anomaly he needs to get to... Hmm, somewhere. I don't actually know where, how he got to where he is and how he can get back, which is somewhat weird, I suppose. But let's try to get back uh, to my home system and research anomalies if possible. So let us see here, what do we have? I can get more food, which is important since I'm currently starving, still even though we made the exchange. So, so far so good. I said this again, even though it's not good, because I'm starving. <laughs> okay, well, I'll try to get that, that under control. Let's see, I can get more food from jobs with this uh, guy running the colony. I'll suddenly do just that, and let's see what I can get on this colony. It's already ha it already has complete. problem with people being unemployed. Well, let's make a farm so that they can work on said farm let's see more people employed on one of my systems man so many things are happening now i'm losing control i went i'll admit that freely Zeno i can't mongrels have declared war on each other Ooh, xenos are fighting each other this is quite interesting so first war is uh, now kicking off kind of scary you know this colony it can do more things for me and i absolutely wanted to do more things for me so let's get another food area more farms, or rather, as they're supposed to be called. Meanwhile, my fleet is doing alright. Let's see if I can actually retrofit it somewhat, like ever slightly. I did get something better, right? Well, I do have better reactors, but that doesn't really help me just yet. I'm waiting complete. for advanced ship rolls. War declaration, yes, I know. <laughs> okay, so apparently war is complete. happening between some people. I don't know these people. Oh, wait, Quentin League. Right, these guys are enemies by their lore. So let's go ahead and check the Quentin League's lore, if it's not too long. So let's see, as a species, the Qu uh, Quentin possesses extreme intelligence which thrusted their species. Oh, it's the exact same lore, right? Well, almost. Let's uh, read from the half of it. This in turn created tension between major world powers vying for unification from government uh, in order to dictate the government in which Quentin could live by. This technological arms race culminated in the nuclear war. On the verge of defeat, the League invested heavily in spacefaring technology, allowing them to open a war for the distant star system with suitable plans for colonization. In their hasty escape, the technology for creating war homes was lost, but using them was re uh, retained so they could we should they wish to go back. Mitro is now where the League resides, rebuilding under one unified government. Very well. Anomaly found. Let's go ahead and research this. Well, this construction ship is makes me some more complete. mining stations. So far, so good. So complete. I'm somewhat threatening, which I feel guilty of, but at the same time, I am z a xenophobe, and I am making a fleet. It's not like I'm just taking nonchalantly and not doing anything else. I am absolutely not doing anything of the sort. Anyway, decisions. Let's go ahead. No, not resettle. Even though I am supposed to resettle as much as possible, but let's go ahead and clear the noxious swamp and the massive glacier as well. Life electric disturbing. Okay, I don't even know what that means too much. I can actually resettle my pops. So this place has a problem. Okay, first of all, this guy is corrupt. I don't want him as a governor. So let's agree to dismiss him and hire a new one. Like this guy. He's wonderful. So now we have a governor that is not corrupt, and we've got two people who are like to resettle. Construction complete. So let's go ahead and resettle that, and send them over to... Four Pops, Six Pops. So Nav Bahar is where I want to send them to. Nav Bahar. And let's send off the unemployed population to over there. And just like that, Nav Bahar now also has problems with unemployed population, which is somewhat sad, I suppose. 
but it can be quite easily resolved. In fact, I'll probably make the system into something that makes a lot of civilian industries. So it, having specialized systems is usually a very good idea, so I'll try to make that a thing. Meanwhile, this system is... It looks like it will be my mining planet, so let's go ahead and start working on that front. I can now get better leader experience gain, which is absolutely amazing, and I can also get FTL inhibitors. But I want more physics research, honestly, that is the most important. Okay, a few construction ships have nothing to do. It's never a uh, very good thing. System survey complete. So this guy, go over here and... Uh, Name it as a star base, I'm not too sure. It will probably increase the Empire's probably even further. <coughs> but I will do want this to be mine. There's another desert and tomb ward in there as well, and I need to drink some tea, so allow me to do that real quick. And let's explore over here as well, because there are some interesting systems to be had. And this science ship. I don't know what it's working for on, but it's working on something interesting. And this one is working on nothing whatsoever right now. So let's go ahead and see what I can find. We have for instance, in here. Non-aggression pact invitation between the consciousness and the protectors of NAR. So this is very different. Last time they went to war, I think, at some point. Hmm, interesting. Can get a bit of society research. I absolutely do want to grab that. And another construction ship is out of order. So let's make another star base nice and easy. Construction complete. And let's see what I can do. I want to trade a little bit more, so... Oh wait, I was supposed to have the decision to go for Galactic Market have nomination, but I no longer have the energy to do this. Oh, that's a shame. That is a shame indeed, I forgot about this, but it happens. Either way, I do want a new module. I want to have uh, the trade hub. And maybe, actually, a shipyard as well, just to have more than just one. I don't need uh, anything else, really, not right now. Or maybe the crew quarters, actually, because I might want to have my army stationed in there. And uh, also some more enemies have been encountered, so... Let's research them real quick, because this will give me some more influence for doing so. Evading hostile fleet, where? Over at Siren, good to know. Well, in that case... Just survey the systems, maybe there's something very interesting going on here. Let's make more mining stations. My Empire's Pro is actually not as bad as I feared. It's 86 above 50. It's pretty bad, but it's not horrible at the very least. My construction ship is done with orders, so let's make more mining stations and more research. New technology is there, and I'm positive on everything, finally. A new inside, let's see. Autocannons are amazing, and I want them. They're essential for Corvettes, and I'm almost done with them as well. We have mastered a new technology. Excellent, so now I can get synthetic uh, crystal plants. Oh, I can unlock destroyers. I do want that. Destroyers are fun. And research alternatives, again, cool research to have. Let's see if there's anything happening in the meta chat. Alright, so... Nothing all that interesting. Quintara League have declared a crusade. Yes, we know about System that thing. Complete. But nothing all that important is happening here. That's a weird one. Okay, nothing all that uh, terribly important so far. How about the power... Oh, those the Quindy Alliance are superior to me. This is somewhat uh, worrisome. Or well, the Divine Mandate is inferior. I suppose this means I could rival the Divine Mandate. System survey complete. Oh, let's leave this be for now. I'll rival the Divine Mandate. Construction complete. And I'll end the rivalry with the Quindy Alliance. Because it's a little bit scary. Oh, I can't end the rivalry just now. So in that case, let's go to Ship Designer. And check if I can improve uh, the Corvettes. I, s I can. I can get them with Swarms. Can I get better ra lasers? No, but I can get autocannons. That's super important. Let's save this change. Nice and easy. Yeah. And let's retrofit all my ships. No, no, no. You stay here. Because this oh, thing will quickly fine. become... A shipyard. In fact, it is a shipyard right now, so you sh those ships should be able to retrofit now, and they did indeed. And let's go ahead and set their default shipyard to Wernall. So home base is going to be that. 
assigned to uh, base. Excellent. And the Kundian refugees have been discarded. Keep to yourselves, aliens. I don't care about you. <sighs> All right. Let's see what else we have. Fleet manager. I am setting up some alloy. Actually, I don't have any more alloys. That is problem. Okay, this construction ship is finished with its stuff. What a waste. Well, I can set it over here. This will not increase my Empire's sprawl all that much. Construction complete. Okay, their fleet power is now equal to mine. So just upgrading my ships was enough to equalize our fleet power. So this is very important. This uh, ship can now make some more mining stations and research stations. And I got some incoming transmission from some traders, it looks like. This is fine. I don't necessarily care about the commerce exchange, not right now. So things are somewhat worrisome. And Construction complete. Okay, I need now I need to link all my emp my entire empire together to limit uh, limit the spread and lower the empire's pro penalty. Thankfully, it will get quite a bit better as soon as I link them. The empire cohesion will go away, and this will be excellent. So I think I need to look for. I think I need to look for somebody who's willing to give me more allies. Systems so let's see if I can find anybody willing to do that. System survey complete. The Xeno Empire has somehow deciphered our... Right, so, let's see if anybody responds. And meanwhile, let's see, ooh, the Walker's Republic of Arius. Let's see, keep to yourselves, aliens. They are supposed to be, I don't know what they are supposed to be, but they're right there. <laughs> That's quite interesting. Experimentary fleet from Walker's Republic of Arius. So they're quite close to where I am. Good to know. Well, so far so good, I'm just exploring as much as I can. Meanwhile, this science ship is now done with all of its uh, survey action. So let's go ahead and survey some more, shall we? And uh, then see if I can check out some other systems. Or oh, that is no longer a priority for me. Okay, how am I doing in terms of uh, unemployment? Anomaly found. Could be doing better, but for the time being, what I can do is just go for Auto Chiton Monument. Which is nice, let's research this anomaly, whatever it is. Over here I have a problem with housing. Well, let's go ahead and make some more housing then. And uh, Nafleg Colony, however it's supposed to be pronounced. Oh wow. That is an energy center and a half. So this guy is a substance abuser. That's fine. If he dies early, that's his problem, not mine. At the very least, he is not a problem to anybody else. So it should be okay. This planet is about to have problems with uh, people who are unemployed, but I can't really fix that, unfortunately, so there isn't anything I can do. Any writing? Okay. <laughs> and yeah, it is kind of hilarious that I can go through one host. Oh, actually, Ethan is having a problem because, yeah, he's fighting against the Quentin League that can walk through wormholes, whereas uh, Quenti Alliance cannot walk through wormholes. So that is interesting. Okay, so far nobody's willing to trade any allies with me, which is unfortunate. I wish they were willing to trade, but it seems like this is not the case. Well, let's make a star base. Is this ship doing anything? Because I really don't think it is. I feel like it's just staying there and not doing anything. So it's serving more systems. Okay, this guy is doing nothing whatsoever. Why is it doing nothing whatsoever? It's beyond me, but you know what? It can assist research. Let's go ahead and do just that. And more construction ships. Okay, you make a starbase and you also make a starbase. Starbase is for everybody because starbases are awesome. Right, fleet command limit would be quite nice. And I believe this to be the most important. Wait, naval capacity. What do I need more? Naval capacity, I think. So let's go ahead and grab that real quick. As I see if I have unlocked the, the destroyer technology. I have not yet. Although I will in just one month. Alright, and when that happens, this will be wonderful and splendid.
We have mastered a new technology. Right. Destroyers have been unlocked. Then with Star Hot or Fusion Missiles. Or Iron Thrusters, actually. That's kind of tempting. Construction complete. Skate Iron Thrusters make my ships a little bit faster complete. and more evasive. Meanwhile, I'm going to go ahead and start designing my newly discovered destroyers. So, I don't know what the enemy is using. That is somewhat, uh, you know, that is uh, an issue you always have to face. But I'm just going to go for a mix of things. So, core gun at the front and auto cannons in the back. And then a bunch of deflectors. Wait, what row do I want to have? Artillery, line, or picket? Let's go for line. This is going to be the ship of the line. And I can go for even more shielding. Not that much help. I need, besides having a little bit of armor, is always good. All right, let's go ahead and save. No, 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 not auto complete. Save, yes, override. And let's change my fleet manager. So I'm going to add this ship design complete. to my currently existing fleet. And I will need a lot more alloys in order to make this happen. So. What do I get, make to make allies? Well, I need the ally foundries, so let's start work, working on those as quickly as possible. Anybody else that has unemployed population and can make ally foundries? Not yet, unfortunately. But I'm working on that. This guy is supposed to be my science center, so I'll keep working on it being my science center. Finish the discovery tree, which allows me to get a new ascension pack as well as increase my research speed, which is excellent. So. Anybody engineering now know Interstellar Dominion is interesting. Grasp the Void, One Vision, Master of Nature, Imperial pro pro Executive Vigor, hmm. Leader Capsize and Shared Destiny, Subject Integration Influence. Hmm. Leader Level Cap is quite tempting, I'll be honest. This unlocks rating. And our technology is too arcane for others to reverse engineer. I think I like this one the most, purely because I should be quite advanced. Uh, no, I clicked on the wrong one! I misclicked! Oh, I misclicked my ascension pack. Whew. This is a mistake and a big problem. Oh man, I'm known for misclicking a lot, but this is next level problem. Like, I got one of the worst ascension packs possible. Well, I guess I'll be... Uh, that's who I am now and what I'm doing. Okay. Let's see. Uh, whew. Let's go to the market and start making my fleet before I announce this stability to everybody else. Because people would get a good laugh out complete. of that. Let's sell some of my food. I don't terribly need it. Let's buy some more alloys because I do want those. And let's uh, reinforce my fleet. We have so, mastered a new technology. Let's get more destroyers and let's get... I, just, I can only get more destroyers. So let's go ahead and do that. Anomaly research and allow me to share with everyone the stupidity that I just committed. Man, this is super sad. Construction complete. Construction complete. Evasive maneuvers initiated. Right, I am now back, and let's see, non-negotiation pact invitation between the Divine Mandate and a bunch of people. Let's see. Divine Mandate, okay, so how about Consciousness? Construction complete. They are apparently pathetic. So the Consciousness I could just conquer if I wanted to. But I'm making a lot of potential enemies, which is something I'm not necessarily too keen on, I'll be entirely honest with you. Make a starbase, uh, leave this anomaly B for now, because I can't research it very well. And yeah, on the bright side, as uh, Gaston Bolcher says, I can now bunker a little bit better because I have more starbases. But again, I would never recommend this research to anyone. <laughs> as, I mean, this accession pack. That's way better accession packs out there. It's a crying shame that I, well, misclicked like that. So yeah, System survey complete. don't do that. Okay, let's see, my capital is work doing just fine, but it needs to have... Not interested to move along, let's see, what do I need to have? Probably some more everything, honestly, that seems like a good idea. Construction let's complete. go ahead, wait, can I get the energy grid? Yes, I can, let's go ahead and grab that real complete. quick. Meanwhile, this colony, it has a problem as well. I'll give it the foundries too. Why not? I need more of them as soon as possible. I have a lot of mineral income, so this is fine. Hoo, hoo, hoo. 
Okay, how am I doing in terms of other players? This guy is superb, but this is the conqueror of this area. Who is now inferior. So this is fine. This guy is pathetic. So I feel like I could change things around. Okay, first of all, this needs a trade hub and let's say... System survey complete. I don't need an anchorage, but I could have an anchorage. So let's go ahead and grab that real quick. Not interested in move along and reset, sure. Why not? And this place, if I create a star base here, which I can't do since my limit is so high, this will make it easier for me to defend, but I do not have the alloys I would need for that, which is somewhat unfortunate. Right, let's keep expanding. Mastered a new technology. New technology mastered, iron thruster. So I can now get more, even more tech in the future. Civilian fabricators is interesting, but I do want to have uh, the crystal mines. This would be fun. System survey complete. Hmm. Construction complete. So, how are things doing? Well, I need to get more research and more mining stations because these are always fun to have. How about this uh, planet? I, can I now colonize it? I should be able to colonize it now. Wait, that's the wrong black hole. Or is it? Elgate? Yeah, I know it's an Elgate. Wasn't there a planet in there at some point? I swear it was. Did it disappear? Maybe it was a fake planet. Okay. Um, good to know. I didn't read any of the anomalies. I guess it was, in fact, a fake planet. Hmm. Very interesting. Well, let's survey the other systems for the time being. And then our uh, troubled so War is still breaking, and I'm sure Darren would be very pleased. Darren is our host, by the way. If we were to fight somebody. So let's see, these guys, they're non-aggressive with NAR, and the fleet power is pathetic. One may contribute to the Void Guardians, sure, understandable, blah blah blah, all this, that's all is good in the world. Okay, let's go ahead and claim more territory. Complete. I'd love to claim this system, actually, because this would be a good system to defend myself with. We have mastered a new technology. New technology research, that's naval capacity, good. I can get defense army damage up, but I'd rather get... Planetary capital, that's quite important to have actually. I have problems with food, so let's trade with now some more. So, let's see. Where is the of a trade here? There we go. Resources, I'll give you minerals. Let's say 500 minerals for 500 food. Let's see if they agree. And what is happening in here? Ooh, Ethan is a little bit annoyed. Ooh, Ethan is actually very annoyed. Yeah, because he cannot fight back against uh, the invaders. Construction complete. Because this is why he is as annoyed as he is. Well, meanwhile, my exchange went through and now I have more food, but I am having some very big problems with energy that are currently unresolved. And I currently have no ways of resolving them. But I can sell some of my stuff to do it, I suppose. Let's see, in here I can get upgrade the structure. Which will increase the upkeep, but uh, plant administration is quite important to have. Complete. Market, 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 what can I do in here? I'm having problems all across the board with energy, to be entirely honest. So, let's look, let's look for a plant that can have more energy districts and is almost unemployed. Uh, and almost has unemployed pops, so let's go ahead and pick this one. Excellent. Those guys are poor. I feel so sorry for E10. Uh, maybe I can... Maybe I can help somehow, but I'm not sure how. This guy is overwhelming in comparison to me, so there isn't much I can do. But this guy is pathetic in comparison to me. Construction complete. So, maybe I should engage in some gunboat diplomacy. What can I demand? Make claims. Incoming transmission. Wait, not, let's not. Wait, non aggression pact invitation. Decline. We. One of my goals is not to make any non aggression treaties. So, how strong are these guys actually? I didn't check. They are superior, apparently. Whew. Okay. Let's check real quick. Uh, what was I supposed to check? Oh, these guys. What can they uh, give me if I threaten them with war? Information, energy credits. 
transfer system opponent better carvey i can just demand better carvey to be mine so let's engage in some gunboat diplomacy but first i will need to fix my money pro well, i can fix them later do i still have my microphone on yes i do well i'll turn it off for a second Construction complete. Right, let's make the trade deal. I want... I want to get... First of all, I want to move my ships and I want to get better colorway, so... I won't make claims just yet. I'll just offer a trade deal. Give me better quality. We have mastered a new technology. New research. Okay, very well. Let's see. I can get star holes. I can get other mega forges. Or oh, afterburners. They're quite tempting. Destroy a whole points plus two hundred. That is also quite tempting. Let's go for that real quick. And let's see what how this uh, this empire respond. Anything could happen at this point, really. I uh, let's go ahead and claim more systems. It's quite important. System survey complete. Market. I need more energy, so I need to sell something. I can sell a lot of minerals, honestly. I probably need them to get complete. better energy, but right now there isn't much I can do with that energy anyway. Nobody's unemployed or whatever, so yeah, I needed the energy as very badly. So let's see you. He's all. This guy's already making mining stations, and this guy. I don't know what he is doing. He's just not doing anything. Well, go ahead and survey more systems. This uh, scientist is really weird. He's like ignoring all my. He's not not showing on the list of inactive scientists, which is somewhat weird. We what about this guy? He's not responding. I think I know why. He's just buying. Uh, he's just buying time, which makes perfect sense. Don't get me wrong. Probably trying to get a better fleet going. And now he's in Fury, so yeah, he's making ships very quickly. Fleet manager. Oh, I need to make ships uh, real quickly myself, so let's see how many Corvettes I can get in addition to what I already have. Only two more. Well, let's go ahead and make those. And let's assign a reader if I can. A cheap one. And let's make some claims. My trade deal was uh, declined, so Construction complete. Well, war it is. Declare war, conquer claim, declare war. We have declared war on the revolting Xenos. Construction complete. Oh, also, I probably need somebody to invade. That's a fair point. I forgot about the armies. Recruit, assault army, guardian rocket. I don't know which is which. I just recruit as many as possible. So the divine minded is now under attack. Let's see if I can actually win this. Oh, that's a very powerful station. Yeah, I probably need to retreat from that and get stronger, uh, stronger navy. I didn't notice that station. That is unfortunate. Well, this will give them an opportunity to fight back. <laughs> yeah, that is a, my mistake. I didn't. I forgot to check if they have, uh, if they have a station here or not. Okay, let's retreat. But I feel like this fits. Something is happening at the very least. It wasn't a good idea, mind you, but let's go for supremacy because supremacy, since I'm probably being somewhat warmongery. Alright, let's see what else I can do. I need to get more energy, that's System very important. Let's see what else I have. Okay, this construction ship. Get some more mining stations going. And I'll need to get a better fleet as well. Hmm. Well, I, to repair it, I need to go back to a system that actually has some defensive fortifications. Well, I suppose what I can do is upgrade this starport so that it's a little bit better defended. In the meantime, I can redesign one of my platforms. So let's go ahead and go to this platform and redesign it with better stuff. It's already quite well designed. Yeah, I don't need to do anything else with that. So let's go ahead and make some defenses as soon as possible. 
Offer our protege. Oh, do good work. Yeah, let's just do that. So let's see what is happening. So far I'm losing this war. My war attrition is almost uh, double the war attrition of my enemies. But hey, something interesting is happening. So at the very least that's a thing. I didn't want to just sit and do nothing, you know. I felt like the enemy war had a pathetic fleet. And now I'm at least forcing them to get better fleet. And now their fleet power is superior. So I'm probably going to get humili humiliated after this uh, war concludes. But we have mastered a new technology. it is interesting. You cannot deny that. <laughs> All right, fleet manager. Let's get more ships. And uh, let's see, Pyda Capital Hall of Judgment. Uh, let's see, can get more research forming gases. Can get some tower blockers, energy siphon. I don't even know what that is, but let's go ahead and grab it. And I'll talk some more. Construction. All right. So I'm now losing stuff. Let's see, what is it? Low stockpile in food and consumer goods. The exchange want a pact. What kind of pact? Commercial pact. Yes, why not? This is a pact I can sign at the very least, so it should be okay. I'm lacking consumer goods quite badly. See, this is a tech world and it's doing very, very well in that regard. But this plant, this colony, well, it needs to give me, get me more energy because it can actually fit that, which is quite excellent. Anywhere else where I can do something? No. Also, I'm completely ignoring this war. Right now it's kind of stagnating. Since, you know, I don't actually have any military left. I actually lost it all in a futile attempt. But, you know, good to know. Good to know. And they have a new branch office at Haven, that being my homeworld. Well, that was to be expected. Nothing I could do there. Let's keep making star bases. And this would be a great place to trade, but right now there isn't really anything I can do. New branch office, yeah, well... I'm fine with there being a branch office on my planet. Can I make a branch office on their planet? Complete. I don't even know how, honestly. Well, that doesn't matter. You did, sir. You're a construction ship that is not doing anything. You should be doing something, so make a starbase right there. Well, this starbase is going to work on getting us... Well, I need ships more than I need a starbase, so... Then again, if I were to make... Crew quarters. That is cheap and it will allow me to have my fleet stationed at over there. So that is Ken Hiao. Exchange the home base. Ken Hiao. Sign to base. We have mastered a new technology. Send them over there. Construction complete. And let's get more ships as quickly as possible. So I can get a few more. I'll keep working get working on them as quickly as possible. Interesting, as some kind of civilization has been observed. I need more everything actually. Let's see, let's see, let's see, what can I do, what can I do, what can I do? Construction complete. So this is housing, more research, yeah sure. I'm starving, I need to do something about it. Let's sell my minerals. Let's buy some food. That's for consumer goods. I will see if I can get some consumer goods from the protectors. So, offer trade deal. I'm willing to give you minerals in return for consumer goods and let's say... 200, uh, 300 uh, of those for. Oh, they have a problem with consumer goods. Okay, never mind. I guess I'll just have to buy consumer goods on the marketplace. Oh! This is an issue. I'm almost out of consumer goods, but I have a few populations that are unemployed, so maybe I can get some uh, civil industries. There we go. Maybe it's gonna be better. So. Better Calvi are now equivalent in terms of their fleet power, so at the very least we're stabilized more or less. They have relatively strong defenses, and my fleet is unable to penetrate them, but I do have a fleet and it feels like they do not, which is quite good and quite important. This guy is assisting, I've got a bunch of construction ships that are not doing anything. Well, this cannot be. This guy certainly needs to start making mining stations. Construction complete. And what is this? IDK, Walker's Republic of... System survey complete. Ooh, this is quite troublesome. We have mastered a new technology. Uh, I don't like the fact that... <laughs> this happened. Okay, Shadow Sentinel. Who is Shadow Sentinel? Because he's putting something in the meta chat. I think he's the Divine Mandate. And he says that the Voilings pose no threat. System survey complete. And that they will try to reform me. Well, 
We'll see if that happens. Construction complete. Construction complete. Hmm. I'll talk to the walkers of the Republic real quick and also check if the stream is fine. It is. Good. We have mastered a new technology. I now have no more, I have a critical resource short, shortage, which is a problem, but I can hopefully fix that real soon. So let's go ahead and buy some civilian goods, and that is now fixed. Xeno fleet detected. Please detect it. Uh, let's see, they are. Hostile Xeno fleet engaged. About as strong as I am, but I do have a station nearby. So let's see what happens. Fleet manager, reinforce. They have uh, covets only, which is, uh, I mean, covets are very good. Spamming, spamming just one type of ship is always a very good idea, since this allows you to simply, you know, uh, this allows you to spread the damage across all ships as opposed to just one ship, because of how stupidly this game is unfortunately programmed. Well, let's go ahead and have my fleet reformed in the void. Send to base, okay. Construction complete. So let's see. It's only losing this. I can surrender. What happens when I do? Not the enemy to enforce all the war gold demands and seize all eligible claims. But they have no. Oh, they want the Kyan Yal. This is a problem. I don't want them to get this uh, area. But well, they're now out of here. Let's see if I can get stronger. I'm losing food very Assistant quickly, which is an issue. Science ship is out of orders. Why is it out of orders? Hey, there's a primitive uh, civilization. All right, cool. And then survey some more systems. Oh, those bastards, they're claiming very good systems for as their own. Let's go ahead and make star bases then. And I'm out of food again, so let's sell more minerals, get more food. For now it is fine, it's uh, not a very good uh, trade of course, I should either talk to a player rather than change it, changing it on the market, but such is the way of things sometimes. So my fleet is regrowing. Fortunately, the enemy has this uh, starbase now, which used to be mine, we have a new which is somewhat problematic, but maybe I can make it better. So let's go to Fleet Manager. I only want one destroyer, honestly, considering what had just happened. And uh, let's uh, change my ship design. So when we look at my cruisers, can they get better? Is the energy itself one better than what I have with the other guns? Doubtful, honestly. Tracking 50 cooldown for a lot of shield damage, but auto cannon is just so so very powerful. So yeah, no, I don't really want to change that. There's nothing I can really do other than get more alloys and try to come out on top next time we fight. So I need desperately to get more food. Let's go ahead and make more food. So far, it's getting interesting. <laughs> Sadly not as well as it could be going, but uh, I'm still alive. And man, the Quenti Alliance and the Quenti League, they really do hate each other, don't they? So let's go ahead and uh, see what is happening. And there are 10 more minutes before we finish this. Okay, so I need to try to turn this around if at all possible. Can I get more alloys? Let's see if I can. The... Oh yeah, I need to mute myself.
Alright, well, let me remind myself what my goals are. Can I get any other? There was more dubious uh, abyss. Singularity. Oh yeah, I can show it to you, I suppose. There we go. That's Those are my quests. I will get two of my quests at the very least. And I got one I will get inside. Well, I suppose this is alright. I got some of my quests done. Construction complete. Okay, so the striker is. Uh, w so the exchange is uh, willing to go for exchange in terms of alloys. So let's go ahead and make a trade deal. So resources, I want them to give me alloys. Minerals. I'm willing to give them 15. So three minerals per alloy. Let's see if they agree. Like this and. Walker's Republic of uh, something wants a trade agreement, but I'm not so sure if I want that they have been claiming systems I would like to be mine, so this is a bit of an issue. Let's see, Fleet Manager can reinforce some more. Wait, are my ships all up to date? Yes, they are. Okay, well, let's go ahead and uh, get some more stuff then, shall we? Wait, do I even have anything at Termark uh, Wormhole? How about now create and trade hub? Oh, you're right. I don't have actual shipyard in there, which is quite problematic. So I need to have my fleet deployed on my home base. That we being... Have a new technology. That being... Uh, what is it? The void with... Incoming okay. transmission. Where is the void? There we go. Why can I not assign those guys to void? I don't know. Peace offer. So the divine mandate... Wants to get this. I'm not agreeing to this logo. I'll take it back. My, my, mark my words. So, my governor has died somewhere, which is sad but fine at the same time. I can also. No, I still cannot do anything with this dangerous wildlife, which is a bit of a problem. Construction and I need a new governor. Nobody cheap. Let's get this guy. Well, that trade didn't work all as well as I hoped. Energy Nexus, quite good. Let's go ahead and grab that. Over here, I can get more minerals. I'll make a folder, star holds. Let's get more minerals for the time being. I need to start upgrading my stuff, though. This is quite important. Construction ships will start working System on as much complete. stuff as possible. Make mining stations, more mining stations. Plus, mining stations everywhere. You make a star base. And unfortunately, use some of my alloys. Let's see, fleet manager. And get one more Corvette. Well, let's get one more. How strong is it that Kian is this hole that Kian something? I don't actually know. I would love to know how strong the station is, but it's hard to say. What else do we have? Ship fire rate, ship up, e produced. Uh, ship build cost reduced. Yeah, I want this. Ship cost, re uh, ship construction cost reduced. Very well. What else do we have? Oh, I can just buy those things. So let's offer another trade deal since they refused the previous one. Construction complete. I apparently cannot do anything. Okay, interesting. Well, my people are starving. Let's make sure they are not starving. Let's get some food. And let's stock with those guys real quick. So we have mastered a new technology. Offer trade deal. Resources and resources. I'm going to give them minerals for alloys. Let's say 500 minerals for 200 Alloys. I think this is a fair price. What else do we have? Leader lifespan plus 10 years. Crime and amenities increase. I like less crime and more amenities, why not? Construction complete. The trade is still not going through. So exchange what do you desire? Exchange, what do you desire? Okay, I now have no more food again, so let's go to the marketplace and let's get more food real quick. Let's see, peace offer between the leagues. They have changed somewhat. Okay, apparently they don't have anything mineral wise. And Ethan, well, Ethan is still alive, although he apparently lost two areas. Right in the middle of his empire, so this is probably quite upsetting to him. 
let's see what that's gonna do. I can make another claim in here and a stop base in here. So that, complete. And once you're done, make research stations and mining stations in that area. It should be quite good. Okay, nobody has enough alloys to really support my war goals, which is a shame, but the war, even though I'm, you know, my war attrition is not the best, I'm still trying to make it work. And now, do I see any of my other quest goals for today? I'm, keep in mind, I won't be able to really complete them no matter what, I don't think. But I can try, right? I can always try, so... I mean, I cannot try, it's too late, there are just a few minutes. So, oof. what is this guy doing? Phenop, he is... He's doing something. System survey complete. He's actually not mine? Who is he? Oh, there we go. I didn't realize I have this many complete. science ships. All right, survey some more things then. System survey complete. I wonder how good these area the systems are. That's why I was so confused. Like there was uh, ships I didn't know, uh, didn't know why they have uh, nothing to do. So yeah, complete. research stations and then our observation posts as well. Let's learn more about the Xenoways because maybe it will help us somehow. Right, we're almost done with it. And let's see what else do we have. Oh, and the rivalry with the Quenti Alliance. I don't want them to be my rivals anymore, this is fine. Okay, what about the machines? The machines are equivalent to those of military power. Well, no wonder, since I'm very, very weak at this point in time. Let's move those guys in there. Can I reinforce a little bit more so that I enter the next day, that being tomorrow, with a stronger fleet? I can get two more corvettes. Like, this is still not enough, most likely. My fleet is very, very weak, actually. But that is the case sometimes. At the very least, I did something and we're now at war, so it's not like nothing is happening. I'm quite happy with that. Ooh, my empire still needs some others, however, so I need more food. Any place where I, I can't get more food? Yes. Let's go ahead and make sure that is the case. More food. Construction complete. Oh, I don't have any more minerals to get more food. That is ironic. That is very ironic. But I can now. Yes, excellent. And this tech world, well, I, there's nothing I can do with the tech world. It is already providing me with a good amount of research, so... Research-wise, I should be doing okay, although... I'm just equivalent to everybody else, so I don't think I'm doing quite as well as I would like to. Which is unfortunate. Is anything happening in the meta chat? Not really, the war is still ongoing. Poof. So, yeah, let us see. I still don't see any other things that I can claim as my quest being completed. I have System gained the singularity, but that's about it. Which is still not terribly bad, I suppose. Why are we going over here? Well, I suppose that this ship can go in there, but instead you could just get some research stations. Research stations are always fun. Complete order cancelled on this construction ship. Construction complete. Okay, sure, I don't know what fit order this was. Maybe the one that I just cancelled, but it doesn't necessarily matter. Okay, vassalization request. So, an empire has been vassalized, so the Quentin Alliance is now vassalized by uh, by the United Studio Nation. Complete. Very, very interesting. So, how are things going? Communications intercepted, and I found the Selendaya Alliance. Keep to yourselves, aliens. So that's the Groot of uh, this gameplay, as he has been calling himself. Good to know he exists complete. and he does things. We okay, have this... mastered a new technology. See if I can do anything with this. Oh, wait, there's a colonizable world in there. I need to grab it while well, I remember about it. So let's go ahead and do that. You, do, sir, go ahead and help uh, research the haven. A new technology. That's good. I got a bunch of new technologies. So over here. I want to grab research complexes. No, more energy credits. That's very important, I think. You can get more Elgate insights. Well, either way, this will not be enough to actually fulfill my quest before the end of this day, since we're about to finish. Construction complete. Whew. This is a wild game, by the way. I really, really enjoy it. I'm having blast. Absolute blast with it. Let's make, get some more farms, since I'm still suffering from the lack of those. Let's get some more civilian industries on my homeworld. 
incoming transmission. An incoming transmission about a peace proposal. Construction so now I will not agree to this divine mandate. And I got to reply to that in one of my chats, so bring it back. Alright, I'm bad. Uh, not bad, I'm back. I'm not a bat, I'm a pangolin, and that's entirely different. Yeah, it is, it is a shame about the crashing. Things would have been potentially different if not for the crashing, but the game did crash a, fun, a bunch of times, so... Yeah, well, what can you do? There are some things that are just impossible to predict and impossible to avoid, so... They happen. Alright, let's reinforce my fleet. Eventually, maybe it will be strong enough to actually fight off against uh, the enemy. We'll see about that, however. We will see. Alright, anything else I can do before this game is finished? Uh, well, I could queue up another colony ship, but I don't have the alloys to do that. I really need all of my alloys where I have them. Construction ship is out of orders. Like some research stations. This construction ship is also out of orders. Well, I can grab some pretty juicy plants in there, but it's more important that I grab some plants in here. Like, there's a rare crystal system in here. So I want to move there as soon as possible. And are we finishing? Yes, the game is paused. Say my GG's and ladies and gentlemen This was quite fun. We're risen tomorrow. Rewards will be given out. New objectives will be assigned I can't wait to see what will happen and uh, thank you very much for watching. This was Pangolin Advisor Been a blast honestly despite the crashing Everything that I just posted will be up on YouTube. I'm not sure on which channel I think I'll post it on my Pangolin Advisor channel since this is kind of a very big event thing but I might post it on both channels simultaneously. I'm not so sure yet, I'll let you know. Either way, thank you for watching one more time, and I'll see you online tomorrow at the same time, that being uh, 7 p.m. Uh, Euro. Uh, what is it called? Universal. Europe Central Time. Central Europe Time. That's it. Or something along this line. CET is it called. Anyway, I'll see you online.